So this is a very simple thing. You can also do it, by the way, with, say, juggling, when you're trying to learn how to juggle. You're entering into a space where you don't have any idea what it would mean to be doing the right thing. When you're first trying to learn how to raise one eyebrow and not another eyebrow, you'll find that like you'll do all kinds of weird stuff. Your face will be screwed up and you'll be making all kinds of weird faces. You'll raise both eyebrows. You'll like squeeze your nose because you don't actually have a path that knows how to do that. You have a sense of what it is you want to do. You want to raise one eyebrow, which is nice, but you don't actually know how at all. You're entering into a complete space of uncertainty. And discernment is a particular capacity of being able to sense that which is more in the direction and from that which is less in the direction. Right. And I can't actually go any deeper than that. It's the ability to sense very subtly, at first very, very subtly, that which is more in the direction and that which is less. So if you use juggling as the example, if you've ever tried to learn how to juggle, there's a, a notion where you're just beginning the process. You're like throwing the ball and then maybe you begin to get, ah, oh, there it is. And like a little tiny bit. It's very vague. It can't be named or described. It's more in the sense of building a feeling and constructing a whole set of deep feelings that have a way of orienting.